Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back for a new YouTube video. I'm so excited to be sat down and filming again. I've definitely had a little bit of a break but I'm really happy to be back. I think I kind of needed a bit of a break to get back inspired and I asked you guys over on Instagram what sort of videos you'd want to see on my channel and a lot of you said styling videos or lookbooks or how you piece together the items that you show in all your haul videos. So I couldn't agree with you all more. I love filming my haul videos but you definitely need some variation and I think it's about time I actually showed you guys how I actually style these pieces up in my current wardrobe. So that is what this video is going to be. Before we get into it though, if you're not already subscribed, please go down there, hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell, that way you'll be notified of when I upload. And also please go check me out on Instagram, my name is just georgiamay underscore xoxo. I ask you guys a lot of questions over there about videos that I want to film and also you'll see a lot of these outfits that I've already kind of styled. Ugh! You might have seen over on my Instagram. Some of you guys come over from my Instagram and ask me to tag the things and just, yeah, every single outfit or item that I mention will be tagged in the description box. I'll do it outfit by outfit. And if I don't have the exact item online anymore, I will hunt down a similar one. So have no fear. So I thought, what's better way than to kick this video off with a how I style a plain white shirt. Now I would recommend getting yourself a cup of tea whether it's just a regular cuppa or a peppermint tea for a health kick, whatever it is, get yourself a drink because I think this is going to be a long video, especially because it's the first time that I'm filming this. So the format might have to change in the future, but we're going to roll with it and we're going to see how the video goes today. I've got a load of different items all over the floor and I'm basically going to start out by showing you three different shirts, how I would style them, how they are so key to your wardrobe. You can dress them up, you can dress them down, summer appropriate, winter appropriate, they have become such a staple in my wardrobe and I never used to believe in that term of, you know, a key item or like, you know, this is like a, a piece you need in your wardrobe. Like I just never believed in that. I always thought, well, wear what you want to wear, but this honestly has transformed my wardrobe using this one item throughout all of these different outfits. So let's get in with the three shirts that I've got to share with you all. I have three variations of shirts, but you just stick with what you've got in your wardrobe or if you feel like you're compelled to buy one of these, then maybe grab one. So we'll start with the the first one this is a satin shirt from plt very simple it's a white satin shirt they do this in a range of colors if white isn't your thing i grabbed the small i grabbed this in the summer I wear this all the time it's so handy it has a really nice oversized kind of collar to it it's become a staple in my wardrobe and believe it or not even though it's satin i've also worn this in the day so it's still multi-use next type of shirt is actually a shirt dress now this i've had for a very long time and i wear this all the time i couldn't recommend a shirt dress more if i'm honest it honestly has become such a staple to me so this one is from miss pap i grabbed this in a uk 10 it literally is just an oversized shirt so if you can't find a shirt dress you could always go for the oversized shirt the next shirt i have is from plt this is more of a recent purchase so this is more of a kind of chiffon -y shirt as you can see it has two front pockets all the buttons all the way down it's quite long it's more of like a sheer material really lightweight and fantastic for the summer okay so we are going to start off with our casual looks and i'm going to start off with kind of the outfit that you guys see me wearing the most over on instagram and i get so many questions about and that is wearing a shirt in the day how do I wear a shirt in the day? What should I pair it with? How do I go about it? Favorite way to wear shirts has to be with a jumper. It is my all time favorite way of wearing a shirt. I just love how it looks. It's really easy. It's so easy. Like when you have nothing to wear, it honestly will transform the outfit. So I would go for my plain white shirt and I would pair it with a jumper. The one that I have here is from Boohoo. I will look for something similar below. I love that you can do a pop of color with a shirt just because it's so simple. I would have the collar over the shirt and then I would just have the jumper. If it's a longer shirt, it's nice because it's gonna peep out the bottom, but don't worry if not, you can just tuck your jumper into your jeans or whatever it is that you're wearing and have your shirt kind of like, you know, untucked and just just that kind of relaxed look. I would either rock this with a pair of light wash denim jeans or my current favorite way to kind of style this has to be with leg leather leggings. I think a shirt with leather leggings is great. It really kind of dresses it down, makes it more casual um, because obviously shirts can look 
very formal very easily so i think you need to do all that you can to dress the item down so i just have two pairs of faux leather leggings here i have these which are from fashion over and they're like my favorites they are a little bit cropped and they have this zipper detail and this faux belt but i love the kind of like faux leather effect they have and the zips on the ankles that also helps to toughen up the look make it a bit less preppy and a bit kind of cooler I am either going to chuck it on with a pair of trainers. I have my Balenciagas, which I absolutely love. So I had to feature them in this video. But any chunky trainer, I own so many trainers. Boohoo do some great ones. PLT, Miss Guy did. I'll link some similar kind of Balenciaga styles in the description box. They, again, help to toughen up the look, make it really kind of chunky and less preppy and kind of formal looking or i would actually go with a pair of docs so this is a pair of doc martens they are a bit of an investment i know they're a little bit pricey but i have worn these a lot since getting them and i really do love them so the ones that i went for are the ones that are the softer leather just because i find them a little bit easier to style they look great with skirts and dresses um but i will link the other ones as well if you are interested and it is just the most simple look but people think you actually have like styled yourself together really really cool so that is my top way of wearing a shirt um just day to day and how i've been doing it for the last couple months really another very similar but great way to wear a jumper with a shirt is going for kind of like an oversized shirt like this chiffon one just chuck on a super oversized baggy jumper this one is from zara and i have so many of you guys ask me about this jumper but unfortunately it's quite old now i will try my best to find something in the dis in similar online and link it below but the nice thing about a shirt is that you can go for a really nice monochromatic look if i can talk so you can go for the black jumper and then you can pair it for something a little bit cooler and this is where i think shirts are great because they give you the option to be really versatile with what else you want to wear or style with them because they are so plain so i would recommend going for a cool kind of trendy trouser now i haven't had a chance to wear these yet and i don't know why because i absolutely love them these are houndstooth i believe um trousers and i just think with a white shirt and a black jumper and a pair of black doc martens this is a look this is really cool oh i i, I honestly love this and i need to quickly hurry up and wear this look because because it's getting a bit warm at the moment and i'm getting worried that i'm not going to be able to style this up so this is an outfit that i absolutely love and i think is going to look really really that cool that leads us on to evening outfits now if i'm going to go for the evening i'm probably going to go more for my miss pap shirt dress this is longer and obviously like i said it's definitely got more of an evening feel to it if i'm going to style this up in the evening the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to chuck on a bodysuit underneath. Um, I'm going to have the buttons undone a bit and I'm going to add a bodysuit. So I have three bodysuits here to share with you guys. The first one is a House of CB pink bodysuit. Just to add a bit of colour to break up the white because it can be quite stark. So yeah, I love this. Again, it's a little bit pricier though. I just have this bodysuit here from House of CB. I get asked about this bodysuit every single time I wear it. On Instagram, you guys ask me about this all the time. It is House of CB. Now, I actually want to buy this in white because I, I wear this bodysuit, I think, every single Saturday night. Honestly, it's just been one of the most amazing pieces for my wardrobe. I absolutely adore it. So I would chuck that on as well if I wanted. Or if you want more of a cheaper option, this is just a Miss Pat bodysuit. Um, I'll link some below. Everywhere sells bodysuits nowadays. PLT, Misguided, H&M, New Look, anywhere. So yeah, I would just stick on a bodysuit underneath a shirt dress. I have the shirt dress kind of undone a bit. And then I'd pair it with a simple heel. And that's kind of the look. You could accessorise. So accessorise with big earrings or things like that. But a fab accessory that I've recently discovered and I'm loving is this belt. I believe this is from Misguided and it's a gold full sparkly diamante belt and it is intense but around a plain white shirt it just instantly lifts the shirt makes it look more glamorous more dressy you've got yourself an evening outfit there so i love this i also think you can go ahead and wear this belt with a pair of light wash skinny jeans and a regular shirt just undone with a bodysuit that would be oh so sexy so yeah this has become a little fave of mine because there are so many ways to style it up alongside a white shirt another fabulous way to wear a shirt is to go for a satin one if you want to do an evening look just the fact that it's satin is instantly going to dress up the outfit she love or styling this again open so completely undone with a bodysuit and just a pair of light wash jeans so the pair that i have here are actually from urban outfitters but i have a, a pair pretty much exactly the same that are from primark so you don't need to spend a load of money or break the bank to get a nice pair of kind of straight leg light wash jeans primark do them i would just style these together undone with a lacy bodysuit and then i'd pop on a blazer 
The shirt and a blazer is the best combo, guys. I just have three blazers here for you guys. First is a Boohoo blazer. I get so many questions on this. I've also styled this up over on my Instagram. It's a lovely stone colour. It's going to look great with the white of the shirt. Um, oh, I just love this combination as well because you've got the different textures. You've got the satin and then the more kind of like suit material. I love it. I honestly love it. If you wanted to introduce a little bit of colour, you could go for a pop of colour and go for a pink. I think pink and white always looks lovely together. And also, it's spring. We want to lighten up the wardrobe a little bit. And the final way I would wear a shirt would be that one from PLT, the chiffon one. Um, I would style it kind of open and undone. And this is how I wore it when I was in Dubai. I just paired it with a swimming costume. And it was my swimming costume cover-up. I think it can look really chic, lovely, especially if you're going anywhere like the Greek islands or Ibiza. It's very that kind of vibe to me. So you could do a pop of colour with your swimsuit. This one is just last year's at River Island and it's blue but I love kind of bright swimming costumes with a plain white shirt. Um, so I would kind of pair it with that and a pair of sunnies or I would go for a pair of kind of like colourful shorts underneath the shirt and I just think it looks really cool and I personally love that look. So that is it for this how I would style video or how I style a plain white shirt. Obviously there are so many different ways you guys can style these items. It's just to share with you maybe what you already have in your wardrobe and how you can really transform one item and just make it so multifaceted. A white shirt has become such a staple to me and I think it's one of those items that you will wear all year round you can wear it in the winter like i said with the docks and you know the leather leggings and toughen it up and then you can wear it undone as like a beach cover up when you're in like boiling heat so it definitely is a versatile piece you just have to play around with it a bit i hope you did enjoy this new style of video let me know in the comment section what item you want me to style up next is it a pair of trainers um is it like you know a jacket is it a blazer let me know because i think getting wear out of the pieces you have in your wardrobe is really really important before obviously going and buying a load of new clothes <laughs> I wish I could stand by that, but you know, I'm going to preach it even if I don't follow that rule. Um, I hope you all did enjoy this style of video. Let me know how you want the format to feel for next time. And maybe we'll turn this into a little series here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Check me out on Insta and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye guys.